is in with Deagle. No opening yet. Molotov perfectly positioned to deny, not give them the space, but Doji's got to be careful in the open in the middle. More so because Bolts is taking out a trend. His wingman, his man above to watch over top Doja. He's locked out in the middle. Nine HP found by KNG, but it's a one versus two. Want him to go down, and they're going to act quickly. They're going to try and swarm in and get an angle. They know he has to go right or left. Both are covered. Both are watched, and Hobbit's going to close it. Gambit will force map three. It was looking desperate for Gambit in the first. Immortals in control of every situation, every facet of the game. But Train, that's when Gambit have come to life. Going up 6-1 to kick things off as well. We did see the adjustment for Immortals. The double orb setup looked like it was enough to potentially come back and have the full reverse sweep. But unfortunately not, it dropped off towards the end. Gambit, so resilient there. Mo especially, he had a quiet game, especially in the first half as well. But when he got on the CT side, that one orb situation surrounded by pistols as well, that was the turning point. And that's when he knew Gambit, we're going to take map number two. Absolutely. And eventually one of those had to go their way. So many rounds that have come so close to breaking yeah. the economy and then had it fall apart. It did take a huge effort from Gambit to win this, but we go to Inferno to decide it. It is turning into a brawl and a great final. Yeah. Better, I think, Mo overall, I think, is the difference maker. But better overall from Gambit. A little bit less, perhaps, I think, from Lucas. Didn't have quite the same entry impact. Their sure. T side didn't, I guess, wasn't quite as explosive. I think... Immortals, especially on the T-side, they're focusing too much on like forcing the issue, trying to get that double orb set out on the T-side. That's not something I want to see in a grand final, really. It, it was slow paced, it didn't really work out for them. And once they didn't get the initial pick, they didn't really seem to have a plan, a backup to that. They tried the fast pace play as well once they broke the economy of Gambit, but they were loving that. They took that all day long. And at that point, we I mean, saw a couple of good defaults, some decent executions there, but Gambit ultimately too secure, looking too strong on our CT side.